We're just we're just going for it here. Just hauling all the ass. Hey, we made it. Okay, cool. I don't know if there was maybe other stuff in that room that we hadn't explored yet, but we're through the door, so that's fine. Rip. <laughs> hey, what the follow? Thanks so much for that. You are awesome. Welcome to the crew, man. You're the best. Yeah, I'll add some. I'll add a hype command eventually. Maybe I'll combine it with some sound effects. In the meantime, though, let's see if I can find a good sound effect. Oh, that was insane! Hey, how's that? <laughs> Blake says, did you hear about the two antennas that got married? The wedding was okay, but the reception was great. <laughs> you. I like you. <laughs> Personally, after my own heart. I, I appreciate that. <sighs> okay, so we got through that room. There's doors here. And then locked from the outside. So is this like... So are we on a ship? It seems like we're on a ship. And this is the brig where we like lock people up. Or, not we, because I'm a little girl. But where they lock people up? Also, I wonder... What if I stack these blocks? If I can maybe get to one of these locks and open it? Let's try it. <laughs> it's a magic place. These blocks don't seem to want to stack very well. No. Maybe I can... Yeah. Okay. No, the blocks don't don't like each other very well. Uh, okay. He says I'll keep bothering you about it. <laughs> I appreciate that, man. Yeah, it's one of those things. Like on my off days, I get some work done. Like I got my new setup. I got I moved my camera. I got the lighting set up. I moved my mic. So the my setup is much more comfortable, and I think the camera angle is better. I didn't get any work done on the computer, so I gotta do that before the next stream. Call me Blake says there's no place where you stack stuff in this game, I don't think. Oh, you still you played this before? Awesome. Oh shit. Um Yeah, I'm a complete noob to this game. I have no idea. I have Sauron's trying to get me. So I'm in the shadow. So if I move slowly, does it not chase after me? Go against the wall. So are those like kids on the ground that got turned to stone from the ISL run here? Is that what happened? I'm going for it. I'm just going. Oh yeah, I got turned to stone. That's creepy. That's super creepy. Okay. Alright, we're back on the brig here, apparently. Not too far back. Alright. He says, I can do that because I'm so ugly like Medusa. To be fair, Medusa wasn't ugly. She just had that curse on her, like snake head, right? Medusa was actually pretty hot, wasn't she? Hot, hot babe. <laughs> he says, so I'm pretty sure I've asked this before. Have you played Inside? This reminds me so much of it. I have not played Inside. I think we were talking about that after one of the other streams, but that's not a game I played. Um, I'll add that to my list gladly because it sounds awesome. And... Okay, we're in shadows here. Okay, I think that's probably a better way to go. And away we go. And this seems to be the lantern seems to be the safe spot. So let's go light this thing. Oh, like I said, this is better than Inside because it's Asian inspired. This is extremely like Inside to my brain. Yeah, I haven't played Inside, so I can't speak. If you've ever seen Spirit of the Way, it gives similar vibes, to be honest. I can see that. Yeah, I'm definitely a Miyazaki fan. I like Spirit of the Way a lot. Um, so far, I don't see the connection, but maybe it opens up more later. 
Yeah, I mean. Uh, I climb up here? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know about Shinkai. I don't know who that is. So, yeah, no, I'm not a big anime guy. There's some anime I like, obviously the classics. Uh, only Miyazaki stuff because it's translated so well to 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 Western audiences. So, I don't know if there's a way. To, do I have to climb up? Maybe climb up and around. Is that what it is? Oh. Okay, there we go. I think we can climb this great. Yeah, look at that. Uh, yeah, all the Miyazaki stuff, you know, I love because it translated really well to Western audiences. Uh, there's a lot of an other anime I like, but I'm not like a big anime guy. So yeah, I don't know who that is. Did you hear about Kima Kimi Nun Nunawa? Newest film to break every anime film record. Never heard of it. Let's check it out. Is there a good uh, Western release, or is it only subtitles? Or what do you suggest? Like the Miyazaki stuff got so popular over here because they had famous Western actors doing the dubs. Oh, here we go. There's another room. Oh, God. Shikama films are also popular, like 5 CM per second. It's a Western release outside the theater. Awesome. I'll check it out then. That sounds really cool. This is the second one of these statues we found. All right, they smash? Oh, they do smash! I should have smashed the other one. I didn't know I could throw things. Blank says, I prefer subs because I can speak Japanese. Oh, that's good to know. I didn't know that. Um, obviously, I wouldn't know that you speak Japanese, but you get my point. Uh, yeah, I like subs depending on the movie. Because um, so often the dubs are done so badly. I think it's it for here. That's creepy. That's like an eye, like handprints all over the ground and the wall. That's man. Oh, uh, yeah. So if the dubs are done badly, then the subs obviously are just so much better. But yeah, I don't speak Japanese. Shinkai is known to make people cry hardcore. What if you're hardcore like me? No feelings. I block all the feels out. <laughs> <coughs> Spooky, do you know what um do you know what Shinkai's all about? Have you heard about it? Oh. Never mind. Hold on. What the flying So there's kids in these beds. Look at his arms, that's fucking terrifying! Jesus. Nope. Nope. Because there's kids in these beds. Can I climb up here and, like, rescue them? Nope. Okay. Maybe I can pull one of these crates out. No, okay. We're just going to get out of this room because I don't like that guy with the arms. Okay, that was terrifying. <laughs> Blake says, oh god, this guy, you ever see Naruto? I always say this guy loses his arms, right? long arm jutsu. <laughs> no, I haven't watched Naruto. Um, I watched a good amount of anime back in the day, like, when I, like, you know, I, obviously, like, Akira was a big one for me. Um, I really liked Tenchi Miyu back in the day. More recently, I, I really enjoyed um, One Punch Man. It was really good. I got to the first season of um, Attack on Titan. So, you know, the pretty mainstream stuff. You know, obviously Naruto is pretty mainstream too, but I haven't checked that out. And jump. Yeah, okay, we can make it up here. Okay, hold on. I got a drink after that. That guy was creepy. That legitimately creeped me out. Ugh. <sighs> 
Uh, like I said, Naruto's a good one to be honest, but so long it has so much filler. I mean, I watched I watched Dragon Ball back in the day, and then Dragon Ball Z. It's the same idea. If you break it down to its basic premise, there's some really interesting stuff going on. But there's so much nonsense in the episodes too. All right, we made it, and there's a rat. So so far, we've seen the kids, we've seen the rat, we've seen that conehead-looking creature thing. <clears throat> this feels like a ship, mostly because things are at weird angles. Like you know, it's kind of rocking just sitting here looking at it. Blake says you should eat that rat. Oh, is that a thing you can do? Apparently she's hungry? Is this a, is this a thing to eat, the, to eat the rat? Oh, hey, there you go. <laughs> I just got your friend's request. Um, I'm not, I haven't been super into Steam. So I'm going to start getting more and more into it. Now that I've been playing more PC games, Steam was always kind of the backup for me when I didn't want to play on console. Oh, here we go. Potato. Nom 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 nom. He says, I sent your friend request on Steam. Hey, nice, I got you. I'll, I'll accept it once I'm done with this. Thanks for the potato, good sir. Woo! So, I guess that's another kid. Can I go... Oh, we can go through here, okay. And there's a noose. What's up with nooses in this game? Evangelion, uh, Plank says, Evangelion is a huge classic and is really deep. I've got into it. Now, all the, I know all these names. You know, I've heard them, but I, I've never spent the time to get into them. I really have a hard time with anime sometimes. Like, so much anime really requires you to be more familiar with Japanese culture, and it feels really odd to watch from a Western perspective. Like, that's how I feel like with a lot of games, too. Like, a lot of, like, Japanese or anime games they don't make any sense. Or I have a really hard time grasping the concepts because they expect you to kind of understand the basics of Japanese culture, and I don't. You know, they can be great enemies or great games, but, you know, I can't really fully appreciate them. But can I pull this bucket? I can't, I can't, can't move the bucket. Um, there's slimes, leech things on the ceiling. I don't, I don't gotta avoid those. I wonder if there's a switch somewhere? I don't know. Can I move this cage, maybe? Can I pull it back? Okay. So maybe I can put this over by that valve. Maybe? Okay, maybe not. Can I pull this one? Apparently not. Okay. Um, I feel like that valve, I should be able to activate it. But maybe... Hmm. Maybe not. Oh, okay. That does a thing. I did something. Uh, Pete says, I, I like just diving in and feeling foreign to anime. Like, just trying to figure things out. I get you. Like, some of them make sense to me enough that I can do that. And if I really know something's good, then it's worth the effort to me. But going in blind and not knowing and kind of just, you know, that's not something I'm into. All right. Unless I know something that's worth the time, it's really hard for me to make the effort to invest into it, you know what I mean? Uh, Blake says, five centimeters per second is a movie that translates well regardless. All Shinkai stuff does, to be honest, so that's why he's popular. I want to get stationed in Japan. Are you uh, in the military? So 
So this pipe burst. I wonder if there's something else to this. I can't move the bucket yet. Maybe I have to come back to this? I don't know. I don't know. Can't move anything else here, so let's get out of here. Okay. Something's gonna happen here. And okay, we can climb up here. Got him. Uh, oh, there we go. So over here. We're gonna pull this back. Oh, we can do that. Awesome. I didn't know we could do that. <laughs> Like says, so I want to be out of the, so out of place, so 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 I wouldn't be so out of place. I'm delayed entry, not in yet. Oh, interesting, cool. I didn't know it was a thing. He says, gonna have to duck here shortly. Gonna play some D two and try and lurk before you get off the ten. Jump over. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> uh, yeah, nice, Pete. Thanks for stopping by, brother. You are the best. Uh, I have decided not to play any D two until the weapon balance patch comes out. So late March. That's my plan. I, every weekend I think about it, and every weekend I know I'll be disappointed. So I've just told myself, no D2 into that weapon balance patch. So uh, once that happens, we will play so much D2. We'll play the shit out of it. So yeah, plan on plan on then. For now, I'm really enjoying these other weird games. And so there's that. Um, so can I open this? No. What if I could make this jump? It seems to be swinging. Woo! Oh no, shit! I let go of the button. Damn it. He says, I'm just a glutton for <laughs> glutton for punishment. Yeah. Yeah, if I didn't have anything else to play that I was really enjoying, I'd probably be playing more D2. Uh, Blank says rip. Yeah. <laughs> In my last game, Blank, I just finished playing through um, Salt and Sanctuary on, on, on stream. And I don't know if you've heard of that, but that was freaking amazing. Super amazing game. Here she says, we need to get more people together to do some raids. Oh, D2? Yeah, I thought about it. I don't know. Eventually, I'll get back into it. I'll be more excited about it. But right now, I just have a really sour taste in my mouth about D2. I know we talked about going back and doing some D1 raids as well. Maybe we'll do that eventually. Like, I'm more likely to play Destiny 1 than I am to play Destiny 2 right now. Hey, there we go. But, um, yeah, no, so Salt and Sanctuary was freaking amazing, and I had a death counter on that. I ended up at 96 deaths, I think, for the game. But considering how challenging that game was, I'm pretty, I'm pretty good, I'm pretty happy with that. <laughs> Took me about 30 hours to beat it, so it's about three deaths an hour. That's not too bad. I wonder. So, um, I know there's a Dark Souls remaster coming out in March. You guys know what time in March? If it's early March or late March, or have you, have you guys heard of that? I gotta just hold on to this. Climb up there. There we go. Where can I go from here? Over there, maybe? I'm up that way? Maybe? I think so. Look, it says, Jesus Christ, finally done with that. Are you still in that same dungeon? And Hail Mary. Hey, we made it. I don't... Oh, I fell. Damn it. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah, so I feel like we definitely have to reach across. But I'm not sure where to go from there. Maybe up here or something? I feel like this is a fuse box, but I can't open it. 
We said he had drink. It was awesome, but there were like ten bosses. Swing. Oh. I gotcha. Also, I didn't think I could climb up here. Let's try that. Let's do that. Oh, and there's a switch. So, I know we need to turn off electricity for something. There's a door down there. Can I go all the way up here? Swing or climb. <laughs> Oh shit, no, that's rip, rip me. Rip. I'm so sorry, little girl. <laughs> yeah, so far the mechanics in this are a trip because. That's flat noise, though. <laughs> yeah, so far the mechanics are a trip because I don't know the objective. So I'm kind of just making progress in any direction I can. You know what I mean? I'm like, I keep breaking that pipe because I feel like maybe there's a reason for it to be there. I don't know. There's definitely a fuse box up there that turns off that door. So I think that's what's at the top there. So we have to probably go up there, turn off the fuse box, come back down, get through the door. That makes sense to me. You said you can also swing. I gotta figure out how to do that. To so go on the top platform to the right. I appreciate that. Although, to be fair, if you, I'm trying to avoid out as many spoilers as possible. <clears throat> uh, if I get stuck, I might, I might hit you up for help because it seems like there might be some things that might be pretty tough in this game. But otherwise, I appreciate it if you let me figure it out. Um, what if there's a way? So, you did mention swinging, and I wonder how I actually get the thing swinging. It doesn't seem to be a way. Let's climb. We know there's something up there. So I guess we'll go over here. Maybe we can make that jump from here. Yeah, okay, we got that. Sweet. Can we pick up this ladder? Um, I just want to pick it up. Can we not pick it up? Alright, never mind. We'll climb up here. Oh. Alright, alright. There's like no dialogue so far, it's crazy. Like says, I don't think this one swings with some do later. Oh, that makes sense. I couldn't fear it. My, my guy didn't, or my little girl didn't seem to be doing anything. Okay. We have to get like a running start or something. <laughs> <laughs> we have to pull this switch first. Let's see. Okay, so that pulls something up. Oh, I gotcha. So we have to pull this and then and then jump onto it and shoot me across, <clears throat> right? Ooh, just made it. Yeah. Clam, clam. And all right, sweet, we made it. 
So far, so good. Uh, <clears throat> I still don't know what the point of all this is yet, but uh, we're making some progress. We've seen some creepy ass shit. Oh, this must be the, the electric, the electric one. All right. Oh, oh. Want to jump up there? Can I pull that one out? Uh, maybe I can pull some of the other ones out. Maybe this one? I don't know. Oops. Damn it. How am I supposed to fix that? Did I botch it? I guess I just don't get enough running start to do it. Hmm. Okay, we can reach it. Okay, good. Awesome. Okay. Not too bad. Jesus Christ. Never mind. Okay, let's try. <laughs> let's try that again. What if the sound's okay? Everything in the game sounds very quiet, so I want to turn it up on stream a little bit and see if it's okay. Actually, I'll, I'll check with Spooky. Spooky, when you're back, let me know if the sound's okay, if it's too quiet or too loud or what. I expected there to be more sound, so I kept it normal volume. But everything so far has been really subdued. I'm going to turn it up on stream a little bit. It sounds good to me, but I also want to make sure the stream sounds okay. Hey, hey, hey we got it. Okay, so let's go through the electric door here. I'll move my cursor in a second. All right, there we go. Yeah, I figured it's ambient, but I figure on stream also, the ambient sounds need to be a little bit louder to so they can at least hear him with my voice. So these conehead guys seem to be on our side? I don't know. They haven't tried to kill me yet. I've rescued a couple of them. Let's push this. Looks like that's a thing. All right. Ugh. So maybe we have to get jump on that. Uh, yeah, jump back down. Okay. This game is freaking crazy. 